um, hey, don't know how I'm gonna figure this out yet. I just filmed a very ranty video, so I thought today was as good a time as any to do one of the painting videos. So, um, I've got some... That was very aggressive. I'm trying to calm down. So I've got some pets to paint. I counted eight, but if I've missed any, it's not because I hate you, it's because I'm disorganised and I hate myself. And I wish that I could put all of my time and effort into every single one, but I'm not an artist and nobody's paying me for this. So, they're not gonna be very good. Here are my rules. I'm not allowed to try and erase anything, so usually if I make a mistake with painting, I'll try and blot it away and paint over it. I'm not allowed to do that. And two is I only have five minutes for each one. So, the first one is from Angsty Kin Skywalker and I absolutely love it. I'm not even as cool as this dog. Let's go with five minutes. Ha, um, where do I even start? I'm gonna try and draw him out first. I'm also not going to cheat, which is going to make it even worse. Alright, you're wasting time, Katie. Shut up. There's his nose. Oh, what a good dog. Got a good old snout. Oh, this is looking great. I'm just out here trying to do my best, trying to paint some dogs, trying to make some people happy. If you would like uh, an actually good picture, there are plenty of artists online, especially on Tumblr, who will... Um, take commissions for it. And similarly, if you are an artist, do not be afraid to charge people, especially when you're young. Like, um, I see a lot of artists on Tumblr, I think there's a big artist community there, and they don't always like to charge people. Like, I've had people draw me before and I do offer to pay for it, because sometimes I use them in, like, I used to use them in end screens and things, and people will refuse to take money, which I appreciate because I'm broke too, but don't be afraid to charge people for your time and effort. If a stranger on the internet says, uh, let me paint your dogs, this is what you should be expecting. How am I doing for time? 1 minute 23, oh my god, I haven't even done the yellow sunglasses yet. Oh my god, I'm scribbling like a felt tip pen. Time, time, 20 seconds, oh. Oh my goodness. Looks amazing. Am I right? Shut up. Um, you know, I think there's a certain artistic impression. Yeah, you know, this is the standard that you're gonna have to expect from this video, okay? I'll leave this one out to dry. Next! Booze Boo sent me this is my kitty, she's named Pitoon. I don't know if that's how that's pronounced, I'm so sorry. Pitoon! <sighs> and she likes to scream. Well, me and your cat have things in common. Five minutes, here we go. She's got some green eyes. Why not start with the, oh God. Oh dear. You know one of the things I miss most about my house in Brighton is my cats that we stole from the neighbours. They know how to knock down the cat flap. I've gone into this before. You know, what? what is this? Wow. Um, okay, I'll do her little pink nose. Yes. D you know what, that kind of does look like a cat, right? She's getting there, we're getting there. We're gonna look great by the end of it. Art is what you it beauty is in the eye of the beholder so you might look at this and think that's not a good picture of a cat but really it is it's just that you can't see it you just don't understand high quality art you just wouldn't get it i will be personally shocked if anyone even makes it this far through the video all i'm doing is painting badly and chatting shit and here i thought that i would calm down after my dressy video. You know, I think it's kind of like abstract. It kind of looks like an angry hedgehog. You know, I really wish I could just sit here and talk about all the standard drama in my life. I did actually the angry video I filmed today. Oh, time's up. Um, well, <sighs> I'm sorry is all I can say. <laughs> I think if you know it's a cat, 
it looks like one. Next. Okay, I'm so scared that I'm saying uh, URLs wrong, but we go and carry on anyway. Next one is from Proudmore. Is that how? I'm sorry, I don't know how I'm supposed to be pronouncing things, and everything I say sounds horrible anyway because I've got this weird northern but not even fun northern accent. Alright, um, anyway. Sent me her dog called Foxy, all dressed up because she loves it when we call her pretty and she puts on a show for us. Again, very relatable. And I'm gonna actually try really hard genuinely try to do this well because we have been mutuals for four years and so I see you. Here we go, I'm gonna try. Ooh, maybe I'll do it this way. Yeah, okay. Here's her ear and a head and another ear. Oh, that's gone a bit wrong. Okay, can't erase it. Here's an eye and another eye. I don't think this one's going well for me, you know. Oh, she's got such a cute little smile. This is a really cute photo. They've all been cute, but like, this is a dog who's camera ready, you know. Oh no, I'm sorry, I don't know what that is. I feel like I should just give up now. I'm just gonna try and do some nice fur and hope that it ends up looking okay. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry. I made your dog look like some kind of hollow-eyed pom bear. I'm sorry, man. It is a really nice picture, it's just I've got not, no, I don't actually have artistic skills. I know I did that last video, but that took me like an hour. <laughs> Ruining your pets since 1998. I don't know how people didn't realise how old I was because it was in my bio for ages, but when I turned 20, everyone was like, what? Loads of people thought I was older, and then someone was very rude and said, Ugh, they're stupid, you look 17 tops. And I was like, that's rude. Um, not because you're calling me young looking, only 20 years old, but hello, don't call my followers stupid, please. Lots of them were being nice and saying I seem older because I'm so mature. <laughs> I don't know what's happened. It seems like they're just getting worse and worse as they go on. I'm never doing this again. I'm going to do the pictures I already have and then no more. Oh, you know what? It kind of looks like a sweet little bear. If, um... If bears looked like that. Some of the more artistic among you may be thinking, Katie, if you stop talking and focus, you might be doing better. And then I might be too good at art and then, oh no. Would I want to be an artist if I was good enough? Probably not. I'm not creative enough, I say. Oh, I say making a YouTube video. It kind of got better when I put in the face. It definitely looks like something and I will let you know when I figure it out but that something is not the picture you sent me <laughs> but thank you anyway I appreciate it this next one is gonna be a hard one to draw but we are gonna do it anyway it's from small honeybee he's a Bernese mountain dog and his name is Jameson five minutes starts now snout mouth a tooth and another tooth and a tongue he's got a big old tongue this one doesn't even fit on the page. I've never had a cat or a dog and I just have this gaping hole in my life where I've had no animals. I had a little rabbit, he was very cute, but um, it's not the same. He was actually quite mean, but we love him anyway. All right, all right, cool. I'm just saying, if this dog was a person, you'd have a great jawline. Ooh, ooh, I have a pink. Ooh. Oh yes. Yes. It looks so good. This was, before I got my hands on it, a very handsome dog. And um, now, he's, um, he's seen better days. Not to worry, still got some white to put in. Yeah, that's good. Not pink at all. Thumbs up. Again, very abstract. Shut up! Very abstract. Once again, thanks for sending it in and I can only apologise for what is an absolutely abominable painting of your dog. We are back, we're recharged and we've had an outfit change because... 
I'm not gonna lie to you because I didn't want to wear a bra anymore and I wasn't ready for YouTube to see my nipples yet. So yeah, this turned out um, as brilliant as the rest of them did. Le let's continue! Yellow Potato Lemon said, This is my friend's best girl, Rue, who I'm pet sitting. If you'd like, paint away. And I will. So, let's go. Five minutes. We're getting back into the swing of things. I don't even know where to start. You know, I want to be creative with this one. It's called Artistic Expression. You can't even see what I'm doing, can you? Oh, yeah. This looks like um, one of those McDonald's Happy Meal toys, except they don't know whether to market it for boys or girls, so they just go for both. I should have put more effort into this. I'm going to be real, and I'm... I'm sorry that I didn't put more effort into your friend's cap. And I wanted it pink and blue, so that's what I've done. She deserves everything. These animals deserve the best pictures. I'm just not the person to paint them. Oh no. Well, why don't I give her a little nose as well? Ah, oh, now it looks like an owl. What? One day I'll be sent to a land where all of these animals exist and I'm forced to atone for my sins. She's got some whiskers. Well, she's got half a face of whiskers. You know, I'm starting to think my career as an artist is really taking off. Free her from this nightmare realm. Who's next? Within my wonderland sent me my pet, their pet, um, obviously. And she is screaming. And aren't we all? Five minutes. Let's go. Can we all just assume that I'm sorry for everything in this video? It's probably yawning. I'm so sorry that I'm assuming your cat is just yelling at you. Fur's mostly white around. Oh. See, if I w was anywhere near monetized, I'd be like, do you think I'm gonna get demonetized for saying the word nipples on YouTube? But let's be real. Since like February, March this year, it's been you have to have 4,000 watch hours and 1,000 subscribers. Uh, to be monetized at all, so it's not really a concern right now. That said, if you know 800 people who want to subscribe, if you know 800 people who want to see this, let me know. Oh, she's got nice blue eyes. I'm gonna do them in watercolor. Is that a mistake? Ah, oh, pink tongue. <gasps> that wasn't what I anticipated, but you know what? It's not horrible. It is horrible. I'm lying to myself. This feels like it's going well. This doesn't, this feels like longer than five minutes already. What if I haven't set the alarm? I have, I have 56 seconds. I think there's only one picture where I've actually fit the whole picture that I received into my painting and it was the first one. You know, when I was really little, I wanted to be an artist. And this is how that worked out. <laughs> You're watching Crushed Dreams live right now. <gasps> Two seconds. Truly nothing screams crushed dreams like this one. All right, final one, I guess, because ho can't count. Guaca Flocka Flame sent me five pictures of their husky, whose name is Thor. I'm gonna pick this one in the dark because it looks easier to draw and I wanna do the bright red eyes. Five seconds, five seconds, oh my God. Five minutes starts now. I'm just gonna use so much black paint. Let's be positive. This is going really well. This is exactly what a painting of a dog should look like, ideally. This is peak art history. So far I've painted everything but the dog. Here we go, here's where it gets real. Why do dogs have black mouths? Um, um, give him some pinky red, yes. Oh, he looks great. Oh, I've got acrylic white. I keep forgetting what I've got, like all the boys who've stopped talking to me. And it's come out pink. Okay, um, well, it's nice. It's like a candy floss colour. It's just like your dog went to a field full of candy floss, where, where candy floss grows in fields. That beep brings me such a feeling of relief. Well, um, if you thought the last one was bad and borderline demonic, you will love this one. <laughs> I just don't know what to say for myself anymore. It's bad. That's all I can say about it. No, posi what happened to positivity? It's not bad, it's just abstract. And it's 
my interpretation and you can't say that art is wrong that's that's that done if you watched all this i have just one question for you why let me put them all together and show you what the squad looks like So um, thanks for watching, I appreciate that you stay with me through all of this. Please go ahead and comment your favourite, I would love to know. I think my favourite personally is um, Thor, because I just think he looks so dashing. Jokes aside though, I did have fun painting these, as terrible as they are, I do think it's interesting how some of them can come out um, so abstract thank you for sending me your pictures in and they they were all very lovely animals i just anyway thanks for watching please subscribe because i love you okay see you next time bye